And uh, good morning to everyone. Thank you very much for being here. Uh, I'd like to start off with uh, just a few uh, special individuals that are here today that I would like to introduce and, and make you aware of. First, Chairman of the Clemson University Board of uh, Trustees, Smythe McKissick. Our President, Dr. James Clements. First Lady of Clemson University, Beth Clements. Athletics Director, Dan Radakovich. And our First Lady of Clemson Football, Kathleen Sweeney. For 82 years, IPTE and its family of donors has supported Clemson Athletics in an effort to provide much needed financial resources for the program. Today, IPTE funds the cost of athletic scholarships, academic support for student athletes, athletic facility initiatives, student athlete services such as nutrition, counseling, and life skills, as well as the marching band. At its core, IPTE is a family of dedicated supporters with a heart for giving. It is my privilege today to focus on two very special IPTE family members. Dabo and Kathleen Sweeney exemplify everything good about IPTE, Clemson Athletics, and our great university. They have led by example and encouraged others to follow. They have a true heart for giving, and that has been manifested through gifts to many areas of the Clemson community. As you will see in the press release, they have generously supported critical initiatives through their All In Foundation and made significant personal gifts to further enhance university need-based scholarships, academic programs, and other non-athletic initiatives. Within the athletic realm, they have generously supported the IPTE Annual Fund at a leadership level, been major donors to the West Zone Initiative, the building which we are in today, been ambassadors for IPTE, played an active role in our major gift prospect cultivation and solicitation process, and been directly responsible for securing major gifts for athletic projects. They truly understand the important role that private philanthropy plays in moving our university and community forward. Today they are giving yet again. On behalf of IPTE, I am pleased to announce that Dabo and Kathleen Sweeney have pledged $1 million in support of the Best is the Standard Fund, which will support Clemson football in critical areas, both on and off the field, as we continue to be a leader in developing our student athletes. this time I would like to ask Chairman McKissick, President Clements, Dan Radakovich, and IPTE Director of Major Gifts, Bobby Couch, please join us as I know that they would like to thank you personally. Let's have another round of applause for this one. Appreciate that, um, and um, I know they put out a release this morning. Uh, but uh, this is a decision that Kath and I made, I guess, back in May, and, uh, and it was a, a decision that we felt like, um, you know, it was time uh, for us to, to take a, a, a bigger leadership role, um, and. Um, I allowed the university to decide when the best time to announce it. That's kind of let them do that. Uh, at first, I just kind of wanted to just do it and be done with it. Uh, but 
but I uh, understand the uh, uh, the role uh, that I have within within the athletic department as well. So, um, you know, but it's something that we uh, prayed on and uh, felt very passionate about, and uh, we're just you know blessed to be able to give back. Uh, first of all, for us, uh, we love Clemson University. Uh, we love uh, this community. Uh, we love the state of South Carolina. Um, and I love the players that I've had the privilege of coaching uh, since I came to Clemson. And, uh, you know, this is our 14th year here. Uh, we're incredibly invested uh, and have been, you know, for a long time. We, we've uh, uh, obviously been very blessed by Clemson football. Uh, we've been blessed by God. And, uh, you know, we, we're very passionate about uh, giving to our church and we've always done that. And we, Kath and I have been married going on 23 years. And when we had a little, we still gave. We always gave uh, to the church. We gave to things in the community that we believed in, um, whether it was financial resources, service, talent, whatever, time. Uh, we've always uh, felt like, you know, felt that servant uh, calling. And, um uh, that's never changed for us, and, and since we came to Clemson, we've tried to always be involved, and, and since becoming the head coach, that was one of the first things that we talked about was, okay, how do we make a difference? Um, you know, when the good Lord takes me away from this planet or away from Clemson uh, for whatever reason, uh, you know, we want to make a difference. You know, we want to uh, uh, have mattered. In, uh, in this community and so uh, we started the All In Foundation and, and we've, we've been able to to raise uh, over two million and give two million dollars and give away and, and through the through the help and support of so many uh, volunteers and people that are passionate about the same things that we are uh, and then obviously we, we've given a lot personally uh, to IPTE because we believe in it we believe in the mission of IPTE uh, I believe in this university I believe in in the leadership that we have from the board to the president to our AD, uh, it's just a it's a special place. And uh, the big thing for Kath and I, as we have just been incredibly blessed um, as we've you know gone through our life and our career, is we've never ever wanted to be uh, you know seen as a taker. You know we we want to be givers, and uh, that's how we've always lived our life. And I just felt like Kath and I both felt like that that this was a time for us to step up and, and take a little bit more of a leadership role. I mean, it's, I've gone out and I've sat in people's homes like, like Bill Hendricks. Uh, and I've, I've met with the Betty Poes and, and we've got great leaders within this board like Smythe McKissick and, and the Michael Nieris and, and I could go on and on. Uh, the people that, that, I, that send money when we started to build this football operations uh, building and I told Dan, I said, I wanna be involved. And I've gone and I've met with people and I've written a lot of letters, you know, people that have given, you know, 50,000, 10,000, 20,000, 500,000, 30,000, you know, people that have sacrificed to support the vision that we have put forth here at Clemson. And that is something that I, I just, I don't take that lightly. And uh, so I've been uh, honored to meet with a lot of these people, uh, to uh, thank them uh, when I've had the opportunities. Uh, but, you know, we don't want to just, again, uh, ask everyone else to give. You know, we want to we want to lead in that regard as well. Uh, and so uh, that's what we chose to do. And, uh, you know, hopefully this will, um, you know, others will follow. And this will set a good example of giving back. You know, again, we, we give we give a lot to our church because we, we love God and we've been blessed and we love Clemson football. And uh, I love specifically the players that have uh, provided me the opportunity uh, here at Clemson and, uh, and the staff that we've had. And, and this, this money is specifically to give back to Clemson football. Uh, you know, and we, we don't all, I don't know what all the needs will be uh, two years from now, three years from now, four years from now. But I just felt like this was an opportunity to step up and uh, be a part of uh, the Will to Lead campaign. Uh, what a special uh, campaign uh, that, that that has been for Clemson University. Over a billion dollars. Uh, just incredible uh, the amount of giving from a university that has about 100 and 
20,000 alumni, I think, something like that. Uh, it's just amazing. So, you know, hopefully, um, again, uh, others will follow and, and, and continue to support the great mission that we have here at Clemson University, the great mission that IPTE has and what it provides for our student athletes uh, because it is phenomenal. And uh, I'm so thankful for the new facility that we have. Uh, I mean, it's just incredible. It's a blessing uh, to, to know that we're going to have an opportunity to uh, have a facility like that uh, for our players to be able to come to work every day and for our coaches. Um, and so uh, I'm thankful for all the people who stepped up to help make that happen and the people who sacrifice out there. There's a lot of people out there who, who don't have a lot, but they give a lot, you know, in, in comparison to what they have. And I have such great appreciation and respect for that. Uh, so again, this is something that uh, Kath and I have prayed about and we're happy to, to be a part of. And, and, um, and also, hopefully, this will set a good example for our, our players that you know go on to be great successes in life. Uh, and uh, for maybe some of them, whether it's in the business world or the NFL or whatever, uh, that they will also have that call to give back to those things that have made a huge impact in their life. And uh, obviously, Clemson University and Clemson football um, has done that for Kath and I. And so uh, really uh, appreciate the opportunity to just address that. And, and uh, Smythe and President and Dan, I appreciate everyone being here. Uh, Max, uh, Bobby, uh, Bobby Couch, uh, he's, he's been a, a friend since I came here to Clemson and uh, uh, worked with us in, in, in getting this thing um, you know, the way it needed to be. So uh, appreciate the opportunity to, to address that. Um, so now we're going to move on to uh, what all y'all came here to do today. Uh, 